So let me tell you about the latest drama in our oh-so-perfect family. You see, my oldest, Bethany, is a 16-year-old drama queen, and she's been causing quite a stir lately. We have a blended family situation going on here, with me, Bethany, and our complexion so white it almost blinds you, while my husband and his daughter, Maria, who's about to turn 15, have a beautiful Mexican descent. Now, normally, their relationship has been decent over the years, considering they've practically grown up together. But recently, things have hit a rough patch. You see, Maria's quinceañera is coming up, and my husband and his ex-wife took her on a shopping spree to find the perfect dress. And guess what? The price tag on that thing was a whopping $3,000! Of course, this made Bethany green with envy. She just couldn't handle the fact that Maria was getting all the attention and spending a small fortune on her special day. Look, I get it. Jealousy can rear its ugly head. But come on, girl, have some perspective. I tried to explain to her that this is all part of their cultural tradition, just like the giant sweet 16 party she had with all her friends. I even went the extra mile and spent some quality time with her, trying to make her feel better about it. I found her a much cheaper dress for the party, hoping she would understand. But no, that just wasn't enough for my darling daughter. In a fit of rage after an argument with Maria over who gets to control the TV remote, yes, seriously, Bethany went full-on vengeful teenager mode. She grabbed a damn sharpie and scribbled all over Maria's expensive dress, ruining it beyond repair. And if that wasn't enough, she had the audacity to rip the back of it as well. Naturally, everyone was pissed off. The house was a battleground of angry words and hurt feelings. I ended up giving some extra cash to my husband and his ex-wife, desperately trying to salvage the situation by getting Maria a new dress ASAP. Stealing myself for the wrath of Bethany, I hatched a brilliant plan to teach her a lesson in responsibility. I told her she'd have to get a job and pay back the entire cost of the dress as punishment. Well, let's just say she didn't take it too well. She thinks I'm being a huge jerk for choosing Maria's side and putting her through this ordeal. Oh, the melodrama! But you know what, Bethany? Life's not fair, and actions have consequences, darling. Maybe this will be a lesson for you to think twice before ruining someone else's special day. You're welcome! So, listeners, what do you say? Am I the asshole for this? This story was inspired by user Otherwise Cycle 2441. If you enjoyed this story, hit the like, share, and subscribe buttons. We'll see you on the next one.